Hey guys, how's it going? Dude Long Couch here. Welcome back to Resident Evil 7. I'm currently staring at the spot where my dead wife should be after I buried a hatchet in her neck, but it didn't take because she's obviously some kind of zombie or something, and she's probably going to jump out from behind the wall and eat my face any second now. I'm just kind of wondering what the hell's going on. I really enjoyed the intro to this game, and I'm hoping that it just keeps ramping up from here. We also got a phone call from some chick named Zoe telling us to go to the attic. I don't really know where that is or how to get there just right now, but I'm sure we'll figure it out. I kind of want to see if I can see anything out this window. No, nothing really out there. Anything in the tub? Can I pull the shower curtain back? That is an unsightly bathtub ring right there. They need some, uh, some scrubbing bubbles. That is my preferred bathroom cleaning solution. Just so you guys know. Okay, I got a little turned around. Back there... Back here is the door that we entered from, correct? Because there's the phone. She... Mia's probably behind this door. God damn it. Oh, that door's locked now. Okay. So I guess we are going to go this way. And... I suppose I can, like, pull any of these down or anything? No. Doesn't seem that way. Alright, onward ho. <sighs> Actually, before we get too far up there, let me just consult my map. Okay, so I don't think this door was open before, but now we've got access to the living room. Looks like the kitchen. There's some kind of item of interest in there. I, It doesn't appear that I can zoom in, though, to like get a closer look at the map. Not that there's really anything to get a closer look at, but I was just curious, you know. We do have a legend here. Your position, tape recorder, and a small keyhole. Oh, so that's what that is. Alright, I would very much like a tape recorder. I haven't been able to save my game for a little while. Guess we'll take a look around the living room. I think we might have seen this picture before. Yeah, yeah, we definitely uh, have been through all this. So we've basically circled around. I guess... I guess I probably could go back into the tape if I wanted to. I don't think I do, though. Maybe that'll change at some point. Alright, so now that we have the bolt cutters, we should be able to get through this door that was back through the kitchen. Kinda want to go upstairs and take a look and see if anything's changed up here. I remember this area being somewhat important in the demo. There's some way to advance up here, but... I don't know how yet. Okay, let me go ahead and pop a save real quick. Okay, that's done. Very good. Oh, I just got creeped out by my own shadow. <laughs> There's gonna be some Peter Pan shit at some point where my shadow gets a mind of its own and starts attacking me. That would actually be really scary. Imagine if your shadow was still attached to you and you couldn't get it unattached, but it was hostile. That's a good idea for like a short, scary story. Damn. I have to write that sometime. That's some Stephen King shit right there. Over 20 missing in two years. Yeah. So, we can gather that these people have been at this for quite a while now. At least two years. I think they said Mia was missing for three years. But we don't know if she was here the whole time. We can come back out here. Can we get outside outside? Didn't think so. <sighs> it's probably full on dark now, so going outside wouldn't really help us that much anyway. Fully expecting to get attacked as soon as I open this thing, but here we go. Hey, we got a fuse. Awesome. Okay. So now we can probably fix the fuse box and activate something on the st- Oh shit! God damn it, god damn it. Was that Mia? I can't even tell. Uh Fuck me, guys. She was having some kind of inner conflict. Like, I think the the very last time we saw her before we, uh... You know... Attacked her outright, she was telling us to go. Like, to get away from her. So she can't really control what's happening to her. It's some kind of mutation or infection. 
I'm so fucking scared. But yeah, I wanted to say thanks to you guys for uh, the great level of support that you brought to that first video. It did really well, and everybody was really nice, leaving nice comments. I really appreciate it, guys. Thank you. It helps me when I'm <laughs> playing this shit and losing my mind. Okay, using a fuse box to restore power. Nailed it. Oh, fuck okay. me! God. It's okay, it's me. I know you didn't mean to hurt me. Uh, you shouldn't have done that! Okay. It fucking hurts! Yeah, I know! Because you did it to me, too! Fuck. Okay, I gotta... Okay. I'm, I'm trying to pull the sink. Oh, she's, she's, what does she have? Let's see what you feel. Fuck! Get the fucking thing out! Ah! What the fuck? She cut my hand off! God, she cut my hand off! must contain the outbreak. Gonna win, I promise. Must. What the fucking fuck? I'm squirting blood everywhere! Is it real time? Can I, like, draw my name on the floor? Oh, it's done. Okay. I can't say I was expecting that. This game continues to surprise. There's my hand. Can I take it? I did. <laughs> I took my severed hand. If I could get a hold of that chainsaw, I'd be like Ash from Evil Dead. I'm actually okay with that thought. Uh, okay. So I don't know why I didn't subtitle her, her rantings there as she was walking away. She was saying something about burning everything down to contain the infection. So even though she's lost her goddamn mind, she is still trying to help. But I certainly can't trust her. Every time I see her, she just spazzes out. And, uh... Bad things happen. I can't believe she cut off my fucking hand! What the fuck? I need that hand! Ah, that's what it means when it says stairs. Okay. Oh, God. I wonder what's waiting for us up here. I don't think I can really fight now. I got two health items and I had to use them both right away because Mia just kicks my ass every time I see her. All right, let's go in order here. Door number one. I'm just gonna... Can I push this closed? Thank you. There better not be like a trap door underneath this blanket. <laughs> Somebody was hanging out here. Ooh, handgun ammo. Handgun! M19 handgun. That's what Papa needs. Okay, fine. Yeah, Ethan, get mad. You're gonna need it. Okay, so we can aim with L2, attack with R2. Very good. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, not waste any bullets, because... Was that mannequin there a second ago? I remember something about mannequins in the demo. Like multiplying or something. Uh, I'm getting out of this room. <laughs> I am gonna have to shoot Mia, I think. I don't think I can kill her, so... I don't know, a, a hatchet wound to the neck didn't kill her, so a bullet to the brain might not either. Might just slow her down. Fucking mannequins. Every scary game has to have mannequins, I swear to god, man. Closing all the doors behind me. Especially now that I have a gun, and I can at least, like, shoot something that pops up in front of me, presumably. Oh, look. Okay. If I hold down L2, I zoom in with it. But if you don't aim for a little while, that's when he kind of picks it back up like that. Got it. Okay, we might be able to climb up there. Gonna have to wall crawl everything now, guys. I didn't even know that this game had guns, honestly, but now that I know, I'm gonna need all the ammo.
like this. Oh shit. Okay, I heard something back there. I don't know if like hiding and stealth is a mechanic in this game. I really, really hope so, because I'd like to be able to hide. Get, like, can I hide under this thing? No. It's not like amnesia. <laughs> Alright, whatever's behind this door, let's dance, motherfucker. Huh? Nothing, just scary noises. Okay. One-handed ladder climb, here we go. What is this? What the fuck? Hi! Hi! Okay, Jesus. Ow! Fucking shit! Stop it, stop it, stop it! Headshot! Headshot! Okay. Gotta run. Ugh. Ah! Make it count, make it count. Reload, reload while she's fucking hurry! Oh my god, I only have one hand. <laughs> Reloading's gonna go slow. Don't understand. I sure as shit don't. Headshots. Headshots. God, is she just immortal? Fuck. Okay, reload quick. Now, 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 now. They're relying on me. I'm sure they are. Jesus. They're relying on me. What the fuck am I supposed to? Okay. Well, she's now she's gutting me with a chainsaw. You are dead, motherfucker. <laughs> Restart from the last save data? Please don't be like that. Please give me a checkpoint. Please, Resident Evil 7. Fighting Mia. Mia is dangerous when she goes berserk. Do whatever it takes to stop her. I certainly will. We got a bunch of these tooltips. Press square to reload, but be careful. Reloading leaves you vulnerable to attack. No shit. Combat basics. Keep your distance from enemies and aim for the head to maximize damage. That is pretty basic. R1 to heal, I already know that. Uh, weak first aid meds will be used first, that's good to know. We got a map. Quick turn, oh, there is a quick turn. It's L and circle. Very good. Examining objects, you can examine certain objects. Yep, yep. And we've circled around. Okay, that was helpful on some level. I guess I gotta, they're gonna make me play the whole way back there. All right, guys, see you in a second. Okay, here we go. I'm gonna try and back down so that she can't, like, kick me and damage me right off the bat. Yeah. Ah, the ladder. Alright, back up, bitch. Oh my gosh, she's fast! Son of a bitch! Son of a bitch, man! Fuck off! Ugh. Back. Back. Oh, I don't understand shit! God, that's hard to dodge. Alright, okay, okay, okay. Must land more shots. Must get used to the way the aiming moves. Shit! They're it's not working. Relying on me. Relying on me. Everyone. I don't know what you're talking about, you crazy bitch. But I don't like you very much right now. I don't know how many fucking headshots you can survive, but I wish you'd quit it. Then stop trying to kill me! <laughs> Jesus, man. Give me the chainsaw. Give me the chainsaw. No, I can't take the chainsaw. I'm so mad. Ugh. Okay. Oh, she's actually bleeding out now. There's no way she's dead for good, though. I don't buy it. In fact, I should probably not hang around here. What, what, is, what the fuck?! What?! Oh, okay. You just came out of nowhere, booted me in the face. Welcome to the family, son. I guess that was scripted. That's good to know. This dude's strong. He's carrying both of us.
Don't you die on us now. You have work to do. What now? Did they reattach my hand? This is a pretty righteous load time right here. <laughs> What the hell? Rise and shine, sleepyhead. It's time for supper. Who, who are all you people? Where's Mia? <laughs> Edith, it's good. Dumb some bitch wasn't no good if it hit him. Okay. Fuck you, dude. What the fuck? Hit boy's got to eat. He got to have his supper. <laughs> I'm good. Come here, boy. Just do it. My penis just crawled up inside itself, guys. Okay. We're alone now, except for Granny Zombie over there. I should really get the fuck out of here. Oh. I don't know what these people are. But they're really, really messed up. Is this person dead? No, nah, she's moving a little bit. Okay. God damn it. Uh, I should go somewhere before they come back. What's this? Nico's Hardware. Saw, rope, and a pet collar. A pet collar costs... Oh, they bought 20 of them. I see. Yikes. Uh... Ah! Ah, she's moving! Is she... I wonder if she's in on it too, or if she's just like so old that she can't help but be along for the ride and she just gets tortured every day. That's a scary thought. March 13th, female 50s, meaty, saute. Okay, so they were feeding me people. Great. Male 30s, lean, gumbo. Male 20s, portly, barbecue. Mmm, people barbecue. Tasty. Alright, I should very much like to have my gun back. Even though, uh... <sighs> didn't seem to do a ton against Mia. It at least let me, uh, you know, drop her. For the time being. Okay, there's obviously a place we can try and crawl down back there. What's going on with my hand? It looks like they reattached it. But I don't know. Huh. Yeah... I actually wouldn't have thought to guess it. It was people guts in there. Ooh, herb! Herbs are back, guys! Check it out, I have an herb! A plant containing nutrients that helps to heal wounds, consumed to recover a small amount of health. Awesome. We'll hold on to that till we get a red one. <laughs> I don't know if that system's back, but I really, really hope so. Oh, look, we can come in here, too. Wait, this is where they went. I don't know if I want to fuck around in there. But I also still haven't really figured out the structure of this game in terms of the Unveiled Abyss. Like, uh, do things work on a timer? Are they going to be back at a certain time? Or do I have, like, free reign to look around in here? And something will obviously get triggered. Select an item to use on this grandfather clock, huh? Alright. Obviously some kind of puzzle we'll have to come back to. Yay, more ammo! But... 
don't actually have a gun with which to administer the ammo. Three missing during Urbex trip. State authorities are asking for help locating three men who went missing during their travels to Dolby Parish from New Orleans on the 9th of this month. The missing men have been identified as Peter Walken, Andre Stickland, and Clancy Javis. So these are the guys from the video that we played through earlier. The three, produce, the three produced videos for the internet and traveled to Dolby to shoot footage for their latest production. Their videos consist mostly of the group exploring abandoned buildings and haunted houses. Yeah, so... That one dude even said that the cop has been calling here constantly, and they know that people have been going missing around here, and it's like in the news and everything. So my question is, how the hell have they not, like, burned this place to the ground yet? Like, do the authorities really not know what's going on here, and have they not done anything to stop it? Because that does seem like some bullshit to me. Okay, there's a garage down here. Hmm... Select an item to use. Okay, that's going to be the locked thing. Let's just gander over here right quick. Ideally, I'd like to scope out like some hiding places or something. <laughs> locked from the other side. Whoa! Hey, let me see my hand again. Oh, I'm like bleeding from the nails. Oh, fuck. I can't be right. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Dude, 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 dude. I'm guessing I want to avoid him. Okay, he's coming this way. I am getting the hell out of here. Close the door. Oh, fuck. Let's try and go down here. Nope, gotta use an item on that. What am I supposed to do? You can't see me back here. You can't see me. Oh shit, oh shit. Oh dude. Slip out before dinner was done? No, I didn't think that. Oh. Okay, running now, running now, he's hostile. I wasn't sure if they were gonna attack me or not. Answer definitely seems to be yes. Fuck. I hate this shit. Secure with tape that can't be removed by hand? What the fuck? Where are you? Nowhere. Oh god, I hate this so much, guys. I think this whole, like, blocking thing, even though it's just putting your hands up, is actually gonna be a big part of the game. Because it seemed like that negated most of the damage that I would have taken from there. What the fuck? Please don't tell me this is the meat of this game. Just like running and hiding in a fucking madhouse with a dude who just like stomps around everywhere. Ugh. The only health I have right now is the come herb. Out, come out, wherever you are. Dude! Okay. He's moving around back in there. This seems to be like kind of a safe spot down here. I don't know if he'll come this way. <sighs> okay, uh, we probably got to get down the hallway where he emerged from. That's my guess. We're gonna have to get a feel for like, what's this? Uh -huh. It looks fragile. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Oh, oh, shit. He found me. Oh, I'm so fucked. I'm so fucked. Ugh. Yep. Okay. Block a shot. And then run. Run, 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 run. Probably can't get in that door. Uh -huh. Oh, shit. What the fucking cock-sucking mother dick tits. Piece of fuck. Power. Mother shit. I'm leaving. I want out of this house right now, guys. I don't like this place. This place sucks. This is the worst place. Where'd the old lady go? Ah! Oh, fuck! <laughs> no! No! Uh, I'm sorry, dude. I'm sorry, okay? Whatever I did to piss you off. Fuck me. Did he just create a shortcut? Is he still after me? Yeah, I think he's back there. 
What's this? Okay. I don't know if uh, time stops when you're examining stuff. Jesus. Where the fuck do I go? Where the fuck do I go? <sighs> yeah, this is the kind of stuff I have to learn. Uh, does looking at stuff stop time? Does opening the menu stop time? We're gonna have to experiment. I also gotta get a feel for, like, how far away I have to run before they lose me. They already know my name, too. I guess Mia told them. I don't know. Didn't really get a chance to look around here because of the psychotic person trying to kill me. It's that crazy husband and wife from before. You don't know him, but you get the feeling he's an asshole. Yeah! <laughs> you can say that again. Shit. What was this? Picture of some person. Is that the daughter? Okay, I'm not sure. Her her eyes were like scratched out. I uh what? What? Did he see me? Okay. Hatch key. Nice. So now we can get through the hatch, presumably. But yeah, okay, I'm gonna take a second over here, and I'm just gonna say uh we saw the mom, the dad, and who I think was, like, you, right? the little brother at the dinner table. But in the picture we saw earlier, there were two kids. I think a boy and a girl. So we don't know where the daughter is. What the fuck is that? What the hell is that? Um, okay. A little bobblehead just showing out there. So, the obvious theory is that Mia is going to be the daughter somehow, some way. Uh, maybe it's a little too obvious. I don't know. I hate this so much. Okay, hey look, there's a, there's a... Oh, it's a bench. For a second I thought it was a noose from my perspective here. I was like, oh, there's a noose just hanging out outside. Alright guys, uh, I think I actually need to end this video here. It's getting a little long in the tooth and um, I'm really, really scared. So when we come back, we'll make a mad dash for the hatch and hope that we can make it before anything else terrible happens. Thanks for watching guys. I love you. I'm Dude Long Couch. See you guys then. Bye.